we're going to yeah i'm going to be sharing the screen sharing the screen sharing the screen Right now, we are sharing the, the screen. Okay. Uh, so when we are going to design data collection tools, first of all, you come to your Google and then you type in your Kobo collection tool and then we come to login. Once you click on login, uh, login, login, login. Okay. So once you click on login, they'll bring the username and then the password. Yeah. Before you do anything, you have to be having an account with Kobo Toolbox. However, in case you don't have, you just click on create an account and then you, they'll bring you a form that you need to fill and then you'll be able to create an account. So these are my login details. I click on login. Once I click on login, okay. Yep, so once you reach on this thing, you just click on new. We're going to create a new form, but now we're going to build from scratch. Build from scratch, you'll input the title. Let's say maybe learning about toolbox part one. So description. We're gonna learn Kobo, Kobo toolbox. You can put any description, it doesn't affect anything. Then uh, we come to we come to the sector. You can select the sector uh, that you're in, maybe let's say humanitarian. And then the country here we in Uganda, you can put your country of residence and then you can create the project. So once you reach, once you reach here, you just click on that additional part and then uh, you can type in your introduction because you know every, every question here must have an introduction. So you say maybe my name is Jonathan and I'm doing this research on behalf of on behalf of your company. So on behalf of go use take go use take. Uh, please, you should put your company's name, not go use take your company's name. And then maybe blah, 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 you can type whatever thing you want. So you come to add, add question, and uh, this one will be a note. Since it's an introduction part, it will be a note. You just click on note. Then you come to that addition. You say maybe what is, what is your name? You're asking the beneficiary, what is your name? Uh, so uh, you come to add question and then you say text. This should be a text part. And then you come to another question. What is your name? Uh, What's your name? And then another question would be, order you should be also a text you come to text 
and then are you married are you married are you married you should be a select one hope you can see this a select one so they'll bring you options you say yes you say no and then maybe a respondent may be not be knowing whether he's married or not so you see i don't know i don't i don't i don't okay uh what else you can also add an, add another question um where is your current location so current location uh you can come maybe here we can get the gps you get the point you can get the gps of the of the of the location you can get the gps of the location and so you come here you look where the gps is that is a geo point a geo point so you just click here where you see this casting of location and then it will show you the location where that person is uh i wanted to put uh, a multiple choice question um what what is your source of income what is your source of income uh when you add the question you can select many you come here to select many so once you're selecting many you say maybe farming you say maybe business <laughs> say maybe self-employed self-employed say maybe office work say maybe what else okay maybe others okay so uh this question has been up for last day after that you click on save hope you can see save you click on save and uh, when after saving you come back to where you're seeing this tick of cobo this log of cobo you click on it once you click on it you come to you come to your drafts and then you see our question then in cobo toolbox part one you click on it after click clicking on it you come to deploy so once this form is deployed that means that someone can easily collect data we can come to where you're seeing this eye preview you can preview we can pre preview our questionnaire <clears throat> and uh, as we're waiting for it i want we want to see if this is real whether uh, our questions can be are ready to be collected as data okay so our title learning Kobo toolbox part one it is there and then our introduction my name is jonathan and i'm doing this research on behalf of go use tech it's there what is your name so what is your name that was our first question you say maybe jonathan how old are you 23 are you married Married, yes or no? Or oh, I don't know. What is your current location? So this is your GPS now. Uh, our GPS, once whenever you click, it will just show you the coordinates, the latitudes and the longitudes. And then uh, what is your source of income? This is a multiple question. So you can either Tick farming, business, self employed office work, whatever. This is a multiple, a multiple choice question. However, this is a select one. Are you married? Yes. Nothing else. Are you single? You get a point. Yep. So I want to show you something else. Something else. Uh, once we copy this form, 
this could be an offline an offline survey so if i bring it and i insert it in my whatever in my google search and then i search that link copy and paste it uh, you will see that it is bringing me to the to the Kobo collection tool and uh, I can easily collect data offline, offline, without using my data. Okay, so this is how my phone is looking like. Okay, Jonathan, I want to show you something. Jonathan, 23. No. Then, uh, okay, yes. Okay, yes, 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 yes. Am I at the source of income? Maybe business, self employed. Okay, I can say self employed. And maybe office work. I then submit. So once I submit, you'll be seeing here in the corner, we have a one. So this means that we have one form that has been submitted. And when we come back to our tool, to our tool, okay. Once we come back to our tool, let's try to refresh it and we see if our submission has come. If our submission has come, okay, you'll be seeing one submission has already been done. So once we come to our data, once we come to our data, you'll be seeing our form has, has been brought up here. You can see what is your name, Jonathan, age 23, yes, our coordinates are there, self-employed. So this is how we can easily create a tool, a question, a questionnaire in our, in our using Cobalt Toolbox. I thank you for watching for now and uh, I would love to stop from here i love you so much may you go and subscribe to our channel uh, may you like and may you share so that this information can help our friends thank you so much